What's going on everyone? Darkwater here, back in Baron Breakfast. Hopefully you guys are having a good day and enjoying the series. I am greatly enjoying this. Uh, I feel like you are out of fuel. There we go. Still don't like that corner, quite frankly. Um, you. I wanted to make some mashed potatoes up here. Need the eight guests, and then I think it'll kind of advance the story forward, which will allow us to do some more. We've got the TV room we can build in here as well. So I think we're going to spend a little bit of time up here. Assuming I can get through doors. We'll drop some mashed potatoes up here. There we go. Oh, great. That's what I was curious. End of the last episode, I was wondering, no. Small fridge does not send stuff through. I was hoping it might, but it appears it does not. So let's see. We got our tape measure last time, so we can have construct from anywhere. That's not what I want at all. I want to go upstairs. So these are kind of seg segmented, but there's a big space here, and I'm thinking about doing the TV room up here. However, the issue that I'm slightly concerned with. is sound. Is sound going to be an issue? You did not actually give me the TV room, did you? You gave me the ability to construct. No, I want one TV. I actually want three more chairs. Now let's build a movie theater. That is a large screen TV. Um, you know what? Along this wall over here. Is it because there's no door? You give me grief because there's no door? Yeah. box in here as well. <laughs> oh, minimum is five by five. Well, shoot. I don't like that. Okay. I don't like these weird little notches. Might be time to do some rearranging of the hotel. Put all the bedrooms upstairs. This area will give us enough space for the TV. We'd have a nice big dining area. Put the kitchen up here by the fuel area. So I think we should... Basically, build up up here, bedroom, bedroom, bathroom, bedroom, bedroom. I don't think I can get two bedrooms over here, given the space. But that would give us enough space down here, 5x5 five five for the TV. Although... Question. No. no. 
wondering if I could just squeeze it in there, but no. No, no. Not enough. Not enough. Um, that doesn't seem good. I might have screwed things a little bit here. Well, shoot. Okay. Tell you what. Let's... Do five of the fancy beds. Can't do the wardrobes. Five of the cute vanities. And I don't have the wood for it. That's fine. We're going upstairs. Uh, we are going to build some bedrooms up here, starting over here. Door there. Bed up there. Cute vanity right there. Fantastic. Build it. Same thing down here. Door. Uh, you know what? We'll do the bed on the bottom somewhere. There. Cute vanity over here. Why not? Boom. No, you are a bathroom. So let's come in, let's craft some bathroom stuff. There. Oh, I didn't even know we got the lavish standing tub. A luxurious throne. Urinate bathroom sink. All kinds of fancy nifts, which makes me wonder if that bathroom, putting it here, uh, give me add a tile down here. Okay. Center it, but I want to move this window actually. There. Get the toilet just kind of over here on its own, and the sink nicely up there. So, what's the area of effect so it doesn't reach over here? That's Okay. So that answers my question. We're going to have to put the bathroom up top, I guess? So we'll do the sink up here. We'll do the luxurious tub over on the side here. Fits nicely, in fact. And we'll just kind of put the toilet way over there. So that'll hit those two. We'll be able to hit one here and one over here. 27 and 19 is very good. Um, go ahead and just put the the doors opposite each other. 
vanity over on this side. And one more bedroom. And just want to add a couple tiles to this room, make it a little bit larger. In fact, we can put the bed kind of in that little nook. And that's good to go. Down here. TV. And again, we'll put the jukebox down over here just for large entertaining, entertaining space. There we go. Is there any negative? No, there's not. Okay. Nice. Okay. Mm, let's drop down a floor. Okay, that, that fixed everything down here. So we actually have quite a few bedrooms now. As well as... having um, a nice TV room. Now, currently it looks like everybody leaves tomorrow. So let's go through, we will book people real quick. Wait, go back, go back, go back. Oh, you're a foodie, okay, gotcha. Yeah, food is, food, food, there's not a whole lot I could do for 22, put you in bedroom 7, comfort is 15, your bathroom is 27, put you upstairs, yours is also 27, put you in bedroom 5, and go ahead and that assigns everybody. Heat is the one thing I'm still... Slightly concerned on, but okay. Uh, still need to build a level 2 kitchen. And I'm waiting on the guests to complete their stay. Let's go check out the shed so we can finish that off. Uh, timber crossing. I don't think I currently have anybody here. Job is complete. Guess we'll now have higher expectations. We've got pants! Character. Pants. Pants. Look, I've got pants on. I've got pants and a watch. The bill unlocks the ability to autofill cooking cards for any recipe. Okay. Oh, I suppose there's more improvements we can do here. Prestige level 3, yep. I feel like I'm already there. Yep. Three... Five-star reviews. Yep. Do I not have the reviews yet? As I'm stuck on a fence. Well, I also don't have guests here, which is kind of an uh, issue as well. You guys don't really matter, because I'm very high on all of these areas, so boom. Cool. You guys will show up tomorrow. We're good to go. Enjoy your outhouse. Uh, you know what? We're gonna walk. 
That way we can collect some stuff on the way down. Gonna check out the motel. I could use some more recipes, but I really want to finish that because I'm pretty sure that's going to allow us to progress a little bit more. Porcelain's a thing, isn't it? Because these piles do contain some porcelain, yeah? Yes. And I'm going to end up upgrading the bathroom down here as well. I think those piles are only stone. Further improvements. Let's stay for 10 guests. Yep. Apparently we've got nobody. Uh, you guys are looking 23 comfort is the max. Okay, I do have a bedroom that's 23 comfort. Um, facilities, no, it's all 14, that's fine. Everybody else is fully within standards. There we go. So that maxes everybody. Everybody's showing up tomorrow, which is good. Um, I think I'm going to hold off on upgrading the bathroom just yet. But I just need those, uh, need the guests to roll through. And I'm hoping that'll get taken care of in just a second. So I'm going to wander my way back up there. Nothing here but pavement from here. Yep, you're right. Um, but I think I'm going to wander up there, do a little collecting of materials. Oh, that's the other thing I wanted to check. You. Best deals anywhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> Eggs. Okay. That's what I was kind of hoping for. Eggs. Doesn't say how many. Butter. Bread. Bread. We're just going to collect a bunch of stuff. We're going to knock out the egg dippy cup. And we're going to take care of that. So I am not going to grind for materials. We're going to go make some food and high lake. Grab some fuel real quick, and in fact, let's go ahead and sleep. Wipe a little drool off. Good morning, everyone. Um, I still feel like this kitchen is just way too small. Or dining room. Egg dippy. We need eggs to boil. Eggs. Is it possible to split one of these off? Apparently that answer is no. 
to roast one bread. And I need Yule. Let's use 51. There we go. Also need a French onion soup. Oh. That is fancy. Uh, I need... I need a slice of bread. Okay, that goes on the other card. Do I not have onion? No. Apparently we are going to do some food delivery today. Uh, let's see. French onion soup. We need butter. I don't know if I can even make this. Because it requires simmer and I don't have simmer. Huh. Okay, that changes the game. Let's go find Gus. Gus, where were you? Uh, no. Give me the world map. He was over in Dark Grove, was he not? Alright, so let's roll on down. Don't mind me, I'm just picking up all your trash. Alright, so rolling over from sawdust. Winter discontent is done. There's just all kinds of wood up here. Thinking about winter discontent, or the uh, up in Winterberry, debating if maybe because there's that that annex on the right hand side wondering if maybe we can uh, go into there and make that a bunch of bedrooms Gus is gotta be up here somewhere hey hey got something for me back there yep fresh out the kitchen ah salty savory creamy delicious tastes like something useful. It's like I'm about to do something useful. You make a mean egg dippy, big boy. Thanks, I didn't lay on it. I only cooked it. We used to get egg dippy maybe once a year, if that. My poor ma, I don't blame her. She did the best she could. We were twelve brothers, and she had to carry us all on her back, literally. And we were all little dumbasses, too, driving her up the wall. Oh man, I don't think my mom could have handled more than one hang. Ah, I remember one time my two older brothers and I got up in the middle of the night to steal pudding. We accidentally dropped a whole bowl on from the third floor. I swear her mouth was spouting fire. I thought I was going to die for sure that night. I was not allowed out of the hole for three straight days. Oh, yeah, it wasn't even the longest I got put in the hole. Did she ever put you someplace nice when you did something good? Like a, a shelf up high somewhere? What? No, that's dumb. Besides, I don't remember doing anything good, like, ever. It was like we were 12 devils put on this earth to torment her, and boy, were we good at it. I don't know, I remember doing a lot of dumb things, but I don't think we ever had a hole. Yeah? How did you get punished? Forced to eat dish soap. The old stick over the paw. I hated that one. 
usually sat down with me and told me what I did was wrong. He usually felt bad enough to apologize and never do it again. Oh. I see. That's dumb. Hey, you know what? When you're done scavenging, I could use some help with humans. Oh? Yeah. See, I'm not a big people bear, and I was thinking I needed somebody with some heart, some zing. Huh. And, don't get me wrong, you don't have... You have a lot of stinky energy. That's right. But maybe that's exactly what I need from someone running my concierge stand. Do you? Do you mean that? Of course, I could use someone scaring the mustaches off a few folks for a fair price. Well, that's one of the least dumb things you could have said today, Hank. Listen, if I come by and help you, I'll need a little table and chair of my own. Always, the undeniable people possum Gus has offered his services as a concierge. All he asked for was a little stand that he could take care of business. Of course, a perfect position for such a charming individual. Okay, that's great. So great. I'm excited. This is awesome. You're awesome. Thanks, Hank. You've unlocked the Gus's Concierge Stand Recipe. So what's... He's going to meet and greet people. Unlock his services for that area. You can turn on his services through the management screen. We'll automatically accept new guests to any bedroom you indicate, saving the time for you to do it manually. You won't be as good as me. Okay. Every bedroom guest manages will cost a fixed number of coins per day. If you run out of coins, the service will automatically stop. Okay. So, he's going to start booking for us. Which I am kind of excited about now. Does he handle all properties or just one property? That's an interesting question. So we're going to go back up to Winterberry. After we grab some wood. You know what? We're going to take a detour. I feel it's been a while since we went down and talked to Mom. the other way. Let, let, let's go talk to Ma. It's been a while. Can I steal your wash tub though? No? Okay. If I have trouble falling asleep, I just start reading my book. Guess my brain would rather shut off than read another word. <laughs> okay. Hey, Ma. What are you typing up, Will? Strike me as a real leave the gun and take the cannoli kind of guy. Yes? <laughs> I hope this guy found something good today. You guys are... You guys, you guys stopped helping me. Do I just have an annex? Is that all this is? Okay. Well, hi, Ma. Bye, Ma. Uh, apparently, you got nothing to say to me. Fine, I've been gone for 30 days. <laughs> And I'm wearing pants. <gasps> Cute little tail sticking out. Um, yeah, it, it's it's fine. We're we're doing fine. I'm bringing a bunch of people to the forested area. 
probably gonna move into your house soon. But it, it, it's fine, I guess. I'm, I'm riding buses now. But thanks, Ma. How is the premier property progressing? It's done. Congratulations once again for fulfilling every hard working person's dream. Making a microscopic debt into the wealth you'll need to accumulate over your considerable lifetime. Just to ensure basic survival. Different locations can support different exclusive amenities due to the rising cost of the industry. Our guests will have expectations for such luxurious comforts. And definitely not because of brazenly inflated advertising we are now legally obligated to disclose. Remember, if you're looking to expand your little empire, our real estate empire, be on the lookout for the pectoral fin of profit. All right, we've made all kinds of progress. We can even uh, improve the establishment. What are we doing? Repair all cabins. Will help you tell the temperature. Absolutely. Let's get ourselves a thermometer. Yep, let's go. It's clean. Let's go. Got everything there. Let's go. Yep. Okay, so I am of the assumption that I can just do bedrooms in here, right? Um, does that also complete you? Yes. Yes, it does. Okay. As I get stuck on snoo. Job complete. Yep. Yes, we'll have higher expectations. They have new items available, and we got a thermostat. What's next? Build six level four bedrooms and a level one lounge. Absolutely. Let's go. Is it done? No. Lounge, special type of room. Some guests are specifically looking for it. That's great. Pawn shop, what do you have? A reliable heater? Can't add to inventory. Oh, that's because I've got a bunch of ingredients. Hold on. Ooh, it's one degree Celsius. Not gonna lie, not a big fan of the layout in here. Um, butter, cheese, milk. Guess nothing else really goes in the fridge. We'll put bread in there, I guess. There's up some slots. That's all that I'm ultimately looking to do. Yeah, I don't like the layout of this, and it's because of the angles, quite frankly. Uh, I do have the lounge built. Oh, I was down here, wasn't I? So, reliable heater. And the large fuel chest. So now we've got those. I still can't build this because I don't have the logger tools, which I'm still very annoyed by. All right. Uh, let's come in here. Let's go into crafting and... Nope, that's too far. <sighs> Gus's concierge stand. Uh, I need to 
learn the recipes first. Back out, back in, crafting. Here we go. Reliable heater. Boom. Large fuel chest. Boom. I also... It's cold in the cabin. Not enough quality food. Um... Inventory, you can go. Can you not go? No. Now I can throw that away. Um, Will you even fit in here? There we go. Now I want the reliable heater. Ooh, that's a lot. Put all kinds of fuel in here. Get rid of that. Old, not of quality food, room's not decorated enough. You're not going to tell me what the temperature in the room is, are you? It's a 17. That's fine. Um, level 1 lounge, we need 6 level 4 bedrooms. In fact, I don't think I have any level four bedrooms, quite frankly. Oh, got one, two, three, four. And not warm enough, which, okay, fine. If I double the number of heaters, does that double the temperature output? Five and six. Um, that's not what I wanted. I need to build. Uh, I need this. Can we go into bedrooms. No, go into inventory. Also, don't know why I keep doing that, but I keep doing that. Now you're at level four. This one. Also come in here and grab the other bedroom or bed. Boom. With window again. I guess we will put it over the carpet. You are level four now. In fact, we can put this nice vanity up here in the corner. Boom. Level. You can get trashed. You can use another chair here. But need to make some food. So that takes care of that. Tomato soup. We need milk, tomatoes, herbs? Herbs. We can make some tomato soup. All right, um, into the fridge. What happened to all my tomatoes? Tomatoes, okay. Uh, milk.
organized. I think. Oh, I do still have some egg dippy left. Uh, tomato. So, herbs. I need boiled milk. Tomato. And fuel. All right, so another eight guests left. We've got new requests to stay. Cornflakes. I've got corn in my inventory. Okay, so let's at least go fill this. Here, have some egg dippy. I've got some tomato soup here as well. I don't have any tea or anything. I really want to complete this because I feel like he's going to help get us someone to cook food. I'm hoping that's going to be a thing. And in fact, while we're thinking about that, let's get Gus going. is affecting this bedroom, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Okay. We're gonna have to change up things a little bit here. What kind of space do I have in my inventory? Not a whole... Throw away that mint as well. I don't think I'm gonna have enough space to do this, but let's try. Yes, we're deleting the kitchen as well. I may end up shrinking this bathroom. I also might put the bathroom up here. But let's establish kitchen down front. my cutting board again. I was hoping I had enough space, but apparently not. If I could sort this, I would be happy. Kitchen, let's try this again. Kitchen. 
door. Fridge. Stove. Cutting board. You are good. Food. Dining room. Nope, that's a fridge. Door. Table. So that takes care of that. This bedroom's got to be better. Decor is up to 17. Okay. Items I might have lost. Yes. Bread. And yes. I don't need it. nice. Uh, let's come down over here and job complete. Yep. Congratulations. Higher expectations. What's next? Build one times movie theater and a level three dining room. Managed from far away. Oh, hey. It's done. Nice. Apparently it is done. People have higher expectations. We've got a pager. Allows you to remotely manage your resorts. Oh, thank God. Because look, I don't even have anybody at the farmhouse. Uh, I'm going to have to do some work in the farmhouse because... Oh no, I take that back. Other way around. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do a little work in the kitchen over there. Now what? Two time utility room. Yeah, thanks. Do I not have a level 2 utility room over here? Apparently not. But I think I am going to leave this episode here. Thank you all for watching. I appreciate you guys for being here. Look forward to seeing you guys again in Baron Breakfast. And as always, hope you guys have yourselves an amazing day. Bye.